I'm on my own, broken alone. I feel the rain crashing down. All around. What up, my fucker Fano? Santa's come early. <laughs> um, big shout out to Max Catch New Zealand. Uh, Armin, you are the man. They've uh, sorted me out with all this kit, and we're gonna go through it. So um, stick around and uh, see the goodies that I've uh, managed to inherit. So first of all, let's get into some Max Catch gears. So first of all, we've got the clothing, obviously. I've got uh, three hats on. Got me a bit of a wide brim hat. Max Catch NZ with the um, New Zealand silver fern and blue, which is which is pretty choice. Just got a normal cap here, the silver fern on the side, which is yeah, that, that silver fern on the side is pretty cool. So we'll just wake that on for now. And um, yeah, just another Max Catch hat there. So yeah, this is. Uh, I got it. I got the shirt as well, which is says Max Catch New Zealand, and uh, oh, and then Max Catch New Zealand on this side, and then the silver, blue silver fin on that side. I think this. I look pretty tidy in this. I think might um, this might be my new dress. My new dress. Uh, dress shirt. She's looking pretty, pretty flash. So yeah. So so uh, yeah. That's the first little bit that I've got. A bit of clothing. Okay, so before I get into the um, the cool stuff, I'm just going to get a couple of things out the road. So I'm going to leave the rods, reels, and stuff for last because I, ha I have had a little sneak peek, and uh, yeah, they're pretty cool. So, uh, but uh, the next item out of my my Christmas bag is uh, my vest. Pretty choice vest. It's real lightweight. Heaps of pockets, so I can forget where I put things. Um, it looks very similar to my camo chest rig there that, that I've got. It's got um, all the pockets in the same places, so for me, I, I don't think I'll have a problem with it. Um, yeah, as I say, very lightweight, um, which is which is great because I spend long days. Heaps of places where I can put things, um, such as my clippers and that, and a little triangle hook for my net. So yeah, pretty sweet. Got the vest, choice. Okay, so down here I have a couple of um, all sorted items that I've got um, also. So, uh, got a pair of gloves, gloves in here. Um, I don't own a pair of gloves, so those are gonna be handy for um, saltwater fly fishing, which I'm gonna get into a bit later, but yeah, saltwater fly fishing with the gloves. Got a, we've got a something. What is this? Oh, yo, it's a buff. Check that out. Check that buff out. That's a sick buff. Yeah, that buff is sick. I'm definitely gonna, definitely gonna chuck that out. Oh. Yo, check me out. So yeah, that buff's pretty choice. They can, they can whack around there. I haven't had a buff before. So, um, it's all pretty new territory to me. Um, got a Max Catch fly box. Fill that up with some New Zealand fishing flies. Don't you worry about that. I'll sit that out. There you go, Reese. Look, mate. Got me an empty fly box. <laughs> um, this thing, which is a tippet straightener, I believe. Never used one in my life, but now I've got one. Might as well use it. Um, this bag of goodies. I'll just quickly run through, run through that. A pair of pliers. This is pretty good. I haven't owned a pair of pliers before, um, so and I do ask Gabe all the time for his, so that's going to go straight onto the vest. And we've got a few other things. Oh, we've got a zinger. The old Max Catch zinger to go on the old pocket, so you go, Zoop. sweet. And uh, to go on that zinger, we have some nippers. Mate, these are so flippin' handy. Oh, what's this? And um, there's a tool there on the end of that that I'm sure everyone will be like, you use it for this reason, but I have no idea what, if you know what that is, is it like to pull the 
hook out of the fish's mouth or something? Let me know down in the comments because I have no idea. <laughs> so yeah, zingers, pliers, pliers, snippers, tippet, uh, straightener, and fly box. So cool. I'm glad to suss that out. Right. Also got a bag of goodies in here. So I've got here. I've got a. Uh, got four bags of tapered leader. That's pretty sweet. Um, they're all they're all zero X. What does that translate to? Let me know down in the comments what zero X translate to. I don't speak uh, gibberish. Um, so yeah, what is it like? Twelve pound or something? Probably for yeah, might be twelve pound. I have no idea. Yeah, as I say, don't speak gibberish. So let me know down in the comments again what twelve pound means. I mean, I mean, zero X means. Pretty sure it's twelve pound. But um, yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. So I've just got some flies as well. Um, got given to me. Salt water flies. So these bad boys. Oh, these bad boys. Look at this thing. The hell's that little shrimpy shrimp thing? Pop 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 pop. Right. You're gonna get eaten. Nice. Okay. And then we've got we got this black black one. Everyone likes a black one. If in doubt, go black. Once you go black, you never go back. Will that carry on? And I'm guessing this is a crab imitation. So yeah. So what a fly fishing looks like this summer boys. So anyway, I'll chuck those back in there. So yeah. So now we're gonna get into the cool stuff. Um, well, the, the cool stuff, the cooler stuff. The stuff that you guys probably wanna see. Um, first, we're gonna start off with, I don't know if I should show you the reels or the rod first. Um, we'll go rod first, cause, and then I'll show you the reel, so it's like the combo. Yeah, okay. First up, we have a uh, ultra glass, seven foot, three weight. <laughs> A glass rod in my hands. Um, I don't know how I feel about that because uh, I, as you know, and if you've been part of the Fakafano for a long time, um, I like to tend to break my rods and um, to get an even more fragile rod in the in this glass rod. Um, yeah, don't know how she's gonna bloody go away. Eh? Yeah, but anyway. We'll open this bad boy up. We'll pull it out. Oh, look at this. You know what the best thing about this is? Bubble wrap. No. <laughs> no. Try, try and get the bubble wrap off without breaking the rod. Jeez Louise. Oh, shiver, man. This thing is super light. Holy crap, I'm going to break this rod. This is. Awesome! So yeah, check this out. Look at that. Oh, what does that sound there? I never read that. Focus. Um, it says ultralight 7.3. Um, what else does it say on there? 3500. So 3500. I don't know what that means, but man, picking this thing up, this is super light, like super duper light. I like the wood carving on there. That's pretty sick, but I think I'm going to have a bit of fun on the uh, Spring Creeks and the Waikato on this. And then we might test it in the uh, backcountry where I know there's some bigger fish, but um, or maybe not. <laughs> so maybe, maybe we might be targeting some smaller fish with this. But I'm going to put this back so carefully, um, because... I just don't want to break it before using it, so we'll whack her back in there. And she can go back in there. Alright, put that up. Coolio. Now, the, the reel that comes with it. Oh. Yeah. So I've got some, got some line that comes with it too. Because obviously I need some line with it. I'm pretty sure it's just floating line. And... 
Look at this, got a pouch and everything. I've never had a pouch in my house. Right. Look at that. So this is just the um, a, a standard Max Catch brand. Uh, three to four weight reel. No, so, yep, left hand wide. So we've got that sus to cut that out. Um, but yeah, no, that's a bloody stunning reel. Check that out. Super light as well, so that's going to be nice balance for um, for the light rod. So yeah, something I'll probably use a little bit more than my glass, but I'm definitely going to get that glass rod out. Anyway, something I'll use a little bit more is the yeah. yeah no, I'll show you this. This is the Sky High Gold. If I'm not mistaken, I think this is their most expensive rod. Um, comes in six. I, I requested it for six weight because that's my um, my most used rod. Oh, here we go. Yeah. So there it is. Sky high gold. Uh, six foot. Oh, sorry, not six foot. Uh, nine foot and six weight. So let's flip in. Open this bad boy up and um, have my first look at it because yeah. So I'm just like a kid at Christmas. I'm really excited, and if I'm explaining this real bad, sorry, but I'm just super excited because um, yeah, never thought this was going to happen. But anyway, sweet sky hot. Oh, see, my camera's not really picking it up, but um, on there it just says sky high. Um, yeah, sky high gold, nine foot, um, four section, six weight, triple, oh, tip flex. So hopefully that means something good. But check out the artwork in there. It looks sick. That is, that is nice. Once again, super light. Like, I'm picking this up and it's just real, 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 real light. Um, yeah. I can't wait to set this thing up and we're gonna have a cast over. Eh? Nah, it's, it's first impression, stoked. That looks sick. It's got the orangey, orangey color. All my rods have been um, black, pretty much. So something with a bit of colors, pretty nice. So yeah, and that's my six weight. So uh, you'll be seeing this one in a lot of my videos because that's um, that's my bread and butter. This, this rod. So. Pretty cool rod. Okay, the stuff I got with this, I got um, some some backing, some 20 pound backing, green. That's gonna look flipping awesome um, on my reel. Well, the, the fluoro green will look cool on my reel when I um, thread it on. Because I've, I've seen the reel online and, I, and it looks pretty choice. I've got some fly line here. Um, pretty sure that's just floating line by the looks of it and um, some more Max Catch um, Avid fly line right here so and I'm pretty sure that's in floating as well by the looks of it yeah floating line and for the for the reel check this out so this is um, Mac, part of the Max Catch Sparta range um, six weight uh, five to five to six weight uh, oh, it says five seven, so five to seven, sorry. Um, yeah, once again, a light, light reel, that's nice. Um, feels smooth on the wind. Oh man, I can't get out, I can't wait to get out. I mean, this this reel just looks awesome. I can just see that the that the backing is just gonna look sick with the fly line, and oh, it's just gonna look so good. I just, oh, I can't wait, man. I'm just like, look <laughs> at Christmas here. Yeah. Look, Max Catch logo on there, and um, oh, yeah, that's gonna look sick. So that's the real. Something that's new to me, and I can't wait to explore, is this bad boy. Now, this bad boy, I believe, I'll open it up, and so it can tell me what it's called. But I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay, let's stay in there. Let's stay on there. I'm not sure that comes out. Nah, she stays in there. Check this out. This whole thing stays in there. And the rods 
nicely packed away in there, so that's pretty cool design. I've never seen anything like that before. But anyway, we'll just get this section out because oh I'll figure out why. I'll figure out why. Put that down there. Got the bubble wrap again. Just try to open up without breaking the rods. Okay, now we're good. So here we have the Predator. Uh, 10 weight, 9 foot, 4 piece rod. This looks absolutely sick. Um, I have seen, Gabe's already tested it, Armin's already tested it. Armin caught an Eagle Ray on this thing. I'll post a picture right here of Armin's Eagle Ray. Like, come on, and he reckons that it just played like a dream. Like So like, imagine, attaching your line to a sandbag and trying to get that in with the fly rods <laughs> that's what an eagle ray would I, I i presume would be like a moving sandbag um yeah but first like this is this looks like a sick sick rod i love the blue the blue is flipping real nice real nice um gloss to it so yeah that's nah, stoked with that that's gonna be this is gonna be in use um in a couple months time I can tell you right now, uh, I definitely want to get get the predator out there and um, just just slay some saltwater fish. Get some different species. Like I haven't got a lot of species on on fly. Um, I think I've got like four species on the fly. So I definitely want to double, if not triple, that um, this summer. So be on the lookout for that. That's going to be cool. All right, the reel. So we've got. Um, some 30 pound backing, because I'm going to need that if I'm going to chase the kings. Um, some fly line, and some more fly line, and here's the reel. Now I've seen this reel, I've seen photos of this reel, sorry, and I know for a fact that this thing is sick. This thing looks sick, and um, yeah, I'll just show you guys. Check this out, check the blue. The blue is just so nice. It is just, it's just a thing of beauty, really. Um, yeah, this once again made uh, the Sparta range of Max Catch. Um, yeah, eight ten, so eight weight to ten weight reel. Um, just a stunning, stunning reel. It's all right. We'll go this way. Um, yeah, smooth as. I can just tell it's smooth. This is just real, real smooth. Um, I mean, I've tried some reels in my time, and picking some up, you can kind of tell that uh, the drag system might not be the best. But um, yeah, this is sick. I mean, that's just so nice. The Sparta, uh, there you go, 8, eight 10 reel. And when with that loaded up is gonna look absolutely sexy and it's gonna dominate some kingfish. I, I, I'm I'm sure of it. I'm sure I'm gonna get hooked on some kings. Alright guys, so that's uh that's my haul. That's that's all I got. <laughs> no, it's just so much. I, I honestly could not believe um the size of the bag when um gave me the bag uh of of how much stuff was in it, man. It's just crazy beyond my wildest dreams. I just can't uh, thank Armin enough for hooking me up with all this stuff for and for starting Max Catch um, New Zealand. It's, I believe that this is going to be awesome. Do you mind? <laughs> um, I, I believe this is going to be awesome. Max Catch as a brand is going to be is going to get huge. Um, and yeah, I just I honestly can't wait for this new season. I've got so many different options now. I can go for little fish on the dry fly on the, for, with my little glass rod fishing really finesse i can do my bread and butter with my uh my sky high gold that's gonna be i mean I, it's gonna be it's just great and um yeah what i'm most excited to use is that predator with that beautiful beautiful sheen reel man that's just gonna be sick but um yeah and not really all of this boils down to you guys my fucker whanau if i didn't have the following that i do um, and the, the support that you guys do give me, um, this would never happen. None of this would have happened. Um, so yeah, I just want to 
thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. It's just, it means a lot that um, you've made a guy's dream come true. It's just, it's just awesome. So that's all I can say. Thank you, Fakafano, for watching this video. If you did like, make sure you comment, subscribe, tell me what those things were. Like, what do they mean? I don't know. <laughs> um, comment, subscribe, give it a big old like. Uh, here's to Max Catch. Here's to uh, the new season. It's just around the corner. I think I will have one video before October 1st. Not too sure. Might have two. I might do a sneaky one to Nongi or something. Get a get a video out but yeah definitely one more video before October 1st and then I'm going to try to do some regular scheduling um, I'm going to make Sunday nights my night to upload so Sunday nights at there we go so I'm making this up right now Sunday night 7 p.m. Um, look out for my videos because that's when they're going to be coming out Sunday nights you know all I can think about is you guys sitting down about to about to just relax before you have a hard week at work and to get you in the mood watch a bit of fucking trap so yeah thank you all for watching I'll see you next time.